I'm Brian Vance, SportBikeTrackGear.com. Today we're going to do a product review on the all-new Alpine Stars Stella Devon Airflow Leather Jacket. The Devon Airflow Leather Jacket sells for $49.95. We've got two colorways available. We're showing you the black right here. They have a black with some pink and white accents as well. Free shipping for any order over $40 to the lower 48 United States. Super affordable and fast DHL international shipping. And really important for the ladies, no restocking fees. You get the jacket from us, you wear it in the house all you need to. Make sure you love the fit before you ride in it. That way, if you need to send it back for a turn or exchange, you avoid every hassle, avoid every fee. And remember, this jacket is going to qualify for our STG Cash Customer Rewards. You buy the coat from us, you're going to get a great store credit to use on a future order. Let's go ahead and benchmark sizing. I've got my wife, Marcine, here with us today. She's 5 feet 8 inches tall, 150 pounds. I would say uh, curvy build. She's wearing a size 44 euro, which they translate to an 8 US. I would rate the fit perfect. How do you feel on it? Uh, eight's pretty much like my go-to size, so yeah, I would say I like the fit. It feels comfortable. Her first comment to me was, and she's she's a taller girl, right? She's like, I feel like the sleeves are, are kind of short, okay? And we want to show you that, and you'll see that I have a gauntlet glove on her right arm, okay? If you had the jacket length all the way down, say, to the top of your hand, okay, it would interact negatively with the glove. So with this jacket, this is a, a definitely a very sport jacket. I would say this partners up best, in my mind, with a gauntlet glove. You're buying a leather jacket like this, you're thinking protection, premium protection. And to ride with this in a, a short, cheap mesh glove, I don't think makes sense. So we've got this paired up with their SP Air, right? Full gauntlet glove, and you can see that that interacts perfectly with the jacket. And by having that sleeve shorter, you don't feel any of that bunching there, do you? No. No, it fits perfect. So comfort when riding, really important. Let's focus on this jacket. It has a fully removable, like quilted body warming liner. It's going to extend the seasonality of this a little bit. It's going to allow you to ride in it when it's cooler out. And then, of course, you remove it when it's hot out. Most of us are fair weather riders. I know that I am. And I love a good perforated leather jacket. It gives you the airflow you need to keep cool and comfortable. But it gives you that safety that you count on in case something bad happens. And, of course, with A-Star's quality, you can count on that in the coat. CE certified armor in the shoulders, elbows, and forearms. It has foam back pad as well as inserts in the chest where it's able to accept their CE armor in the chest. You can upgrade the back armor as well. Storage pockets, hand warmer style both sides. There's going to be a waterproof storage pocket on the left breast. Great place to put your smartphone. Reflective inserts here. If you go ahead and rotate please motion panel here in the elbow and they've done that in a highly abrasion resistant textile that allows the jacket to really move well and not fight you when you're riding additional perforation here perforation in the underarm if you want to go ahead and put your back to the camera we've got more reflective inserts here perforation here at the base of the neck that's a hot spot segmented perf back here you can see the tail of the jacket is a little bit of a drop tail, okay? Because remember, when you get in that riding position, you want less material up front and more material in the back, and they've addressed that with this coat. You go ahead, side to the camera, please, and you can see we have a volume adjustment here in the waist. It's leather with metal, metal snaps, and they use the abrasion-resistant textile underneath it. And you can clearly see the cut of this coat. You have that drop tail less in the front. That means when she's sitting on the bike, you're not going to have the jacket pushing up in the front, so it keeps it cooler, more comfortable, avoids the bunching. If you like what you see so far and you want more details, stay tuned. We'll get the jacket off or disassemble it and give you a closer look from the inside out. All right, here we go, inside out, the Stella Devon Airflow Leather Jacket. It's going to come with a foam back pad in there. No CE certification, it does offer some protection that is easily and affordably upgraded to a CE piece. If you prefer, you will find that in the Alpine Stars Armor section of our website. The jacket also has provisions to accept the CE certified chest armor. Additionally, that will be found in the same spot as the back pad. CE armor that's included, elbow and forearm, as well as shoulder. What's really important to focus on here is the thickness of this. This is very low profile, so it doesn't give you that kind of stormtrooper-ish look, right? It really stays true to the lines of the coat and doesn't add a lot of bulk while providing a very high level 
of protection. As you can see, they're not just putting men's armor in here. These are all done in ladies profiles to really hug the shoulder and the elbow and forearm. The jacket includes a fully removable quilted liner. They've integrated stretch fabric into the arms. This is a high-end coat, right? This is a high-end performance protective coat. This helps the jacket when you have the liner to move with you instead of fight you. Storage pockets built into the liner on both sides with a Velcro closure. The shell of the coat itself, all premium leather, tons of perforation. The theme here is really airflow. When you add a layer like this leather jacket, it certainly is going to amp up the heat a little bit. By having all the perforation, it's really going to help to keep you cool and comfortable. End of the day, if you're going to ride on the street, there is a difference in protection between mesh, textile, and leather. Leather being the most protective of the bunch. Having a highly perforated jacket really keeps the cooling where it needs to be during those nice days. Reflective inserts. Abrasion resistant stretch fabric is used here as a motion panel. This really helps the jacket to move well on your body so it doesn't fight you. Very subtle logoing on this jacket. Right, little embroidered logo there. Some embroidery here. Fabric motion panel there in the elbow. Entry and exit is managed with a locking zipper. Got a volume adjuster here done with leather and a snap. Two external storage pockets, hand warmer style with zippered closures. More reflective inserts. Tons of perforation here in the front. Volume adjustment at the waist. Inside the coat, this jacket includes a waterproof storage pocket, perfect spot for your smartphone, right? You get caught in some weather when you're out there unexpectedly, keep that device safe in that pocket. Storage pocket here, left side Velcro closure, right side, once again, Velcro closure. If you're into real high-end protection, you're able to use the Alpine Stars back protector, right? The race level. Snap it right here. Let's say that's not something you're interested in. This little piece removes from the coat so it's not in your way. Personally, myself, with the jackets, what I prefer is installing the CE certified insert inside the pocket right here. It's easy to do. It integrates it into the coat so you're not dealing with a separate piece of protection. Additionally, if you choose to install those armor inserts in the chest, you'll access them through this pocket and migrate your way up to this area of the coat. You're going to find the actual Velcro closure for that chest pocket right there. You want to zip these to a pair of riding pants. Full circumference zipper here. Nice, comfortable, high-end mesh liner. Spacer fabric used here in the collar. This is a great coat. Real heirloom quality. You'll have this for many, many years. Looks great on, too. I think it looked phenomenal on my wife. Good-looking jacket. One thing they did really well here is having that little drop tail, right? You need that little additional coverage at the back and you want it a little shorter in the front so that when you're sitting on the motorcycle, it's not pushing up and bunching. This is the Alpine Stars Stella Devon Airflow Leather Jacket.